Hey guys, let's do some yoga. Thanks for watching. Sorry, because um, I forgot to bring my tripod. Today is a bit hot. It's gonna be 41 degrees later. Western Australia is summertime here. So yeah. Well it's only 10 o'clock, so it's not that bad now. But soon it's going to be 41 degrees Celsius here. Some stretching. This is good for your shoulder. Stretch. Hill here. It's not a good spot, but that's the only shit I could find. Need to be underneath the tree. It's too, it's too sunny. I'm close to the main road, but this is uh, Armadale Park. So it's a bit noisy in there, it's main road and it's all the shopping centers just in the front. So yeah, so car's noise is pretty bad. But the thing is it's got good trees at the back and there's a little bit of lake there. But more stretching. If it's too hot, you cannot go outside. It's just too the humidity humidity is quite bad. So yeah, I don't really like go like going outside to do a workout. But it's only 10 o'clock at this time, so it's not that bad now. I love winter than summer for sure. Because during winter time I will have a good sleep, but not summer time unless you have put your air conditioning 24 hours or else you cannot sleep. It's big ants on that. There's a lot of ants here. There's not many people. 
people here. There's a lot of ducks at the back behind me. That's one family there. Just people don't want to go outside while it's hot. They would rather stay inside the house and watch Netflix 24 hours. <laughs> if I just do that, I get really tired. Needs to do something. Well, today, I've got few jobs. But if I'm not working, I need to do something. I need to do some work out, at least some stretching. <sighs> Losing my muscle. Okay, other side. My neck is pretty tense. You know, when you drive too much, and my work is I always drive it. I always drive, driving at least four hours a day. Because I need to see my clients. So it's not good for your neck while you're driving too long. Get really tense and muscle tense around my neck. So I need to do a little bit stretching, neck exercise. It feels good. I love massage, but it's too costly here. When I went to Thailand, I had a massage like almost every day. Like really strong massage, like cracking the bones. <laughs> I love that. But here I cannot afford it. It's too expensive in Australia when you go to the massage parlor. So what charging like $60 an hour. In Thailand, I could have three hours for the same price. If I go to us, like if I like to go to uh, for holiday, like Thailand or Bali, straight away I like to go to the massage parlor. It's just so relaxing. Uh, just cracking my bones, it's good. I used to go to the chiropractor as well. You know, when you do like adjust your bones like that and your posture, make your posture. Um, in the right direction I love it I really like it but it's too expensive I've been like few times but it's like 15 minutes of charging like $80 it's ridiculous doing 15 minutes is 80 bucks cost too much it's too much I have my private insurance but yeah I might just check my private insurance my health private insurance some of them will cover chiropractor and physiotherapy like that. But you still need to pay something out of your pocket. It's not totally free. And every time you claim, you need to pay uh, some money on the front. Uh, I love doing this. It's just so good. I feel good. My arms, my shoulder. Stretch all the big answers on the phone. <laughs> all right, I like this one too. It's really squeeze your belly and then squeeze it, hold it for at least 20 seconds. It's good when you it's good for your back, then release. You just release it and stretch your hips. And I squeeze again. And release. Okay, I feel good my my hips and my back. Around Australia, most states in Australia is flooding of virus. Like some other state in New York, Sydney was like last week was like 50,000 a day cases, which is terrible and a lot of deaths. In one week, 1,000 people died. It's terrible. But we're in this side. Western Australia is different story. The place I live, 
we shut down the country, we shut down the state unless medical exemption, compassionate reason like if you have relatives here to see like they're dying, something like that very strict rules which is good we only have like um, seven communities spread yesterday and it was 10 10 cases yesterday which is good but Omicron is so rapidly spread and very contagious so just like most states of Australia except Western Australia are flooding of virus I don't understand why people some people wants to travel while on this pandemic and then when they get the virus cuts the virus they just they don't some of them they don't isolate themselves they escape from hotel and then they just not really they don't feel guilty when they spread the virus and kill someone it's ridiculous it's terrible well some people doing the right thing but some are really bad they don't even isolate themselves they just want like travel there and here and spread the virus and kill someone and they don't know if they spread that someone's gonna die especially older people it's terrible no conscience all right i'm lucky that i live in the state of western australia less very strict rules shut down international travel even Australian people some Australia some Australian people cannot come in here because their state is full um, it's a lot of virus there cases we don't want that here it's too bad stretch Getting you, it's getting hot here now. Right. So, it's got some ants, big black ants. Sometimes it's quite really painful when they bite you. That's Australian bird, that noise. What's that name? That bird, Kakatu. It's a really weird no oh, sounds. This is good for your legs. If you want to tone your legs, this one doing this. Right. Sun is coming here this side and this shade. This is one of the extra stars that you want to tone your legs.
Whew. I'm sweating now. It's getting hot. Okay. Start a sweat. Oh my gosh, I forgot to bring my water. Oh. Thing is when I do work out I constantly want to drink water I can't believe it I just forget to bring my water wonder if there's a tap here usually there is tap on the they put tap on the on the park but this is the first time I've been here this is close to one of my clients' house. But I'll find any top. smell of that water is not so nice it's like it's not like a fresh water like I don't know it stays in there it doesn't like it's a smell that fountain the water is a bit smelly oh yeah uh, other side Saturday today 22 of January 2022 it's um it's summer season in Western Australia in Australia all over Australia Western Australia is quite very hot here sometimes it gets humid Somewhere part of north of Western Australia gets to 50 degrees Celsius. It's boiling hot. I love, I love winter. Winter starts uh, June, May, June. I love June. I love winter. I have a good sleep. Nice and cool.
I really love stretching but it's terrible when the weather's hot sweat it's like especially humid I'm sweating a lot if my throat gets dry because I forgot to bring my water I need to stop my video guys <laughs> it's like sometimes when I do workouts and then I keep sweating and no water one time I feel like I kind of hardly breathe it's just my throat is so dry like oh my god it was terrible that's why I always bring water when I do my workout but I forgot again it was in the in my car okay let's do more of this Stretch arm. Squeeze your arm. I forgot to bring my tripod camera holder <laughs> it's not very good huh? position of my camera I just put I'm behind the tree leaning on the tree Oh, I'm sweating like crazy. Oh, they didn't bring a towel either. I wasn't prepared, really. This is my last job. I said to myself, I got like one hour break. So I do a little bit stretching here near in this nice beautiful garden with a fountain. So I wasn't prepared at all. Sometimes I look like, oh, that's nice to do some stretching on that garden there. Underneath the trees, feel good. Right. to do neck exercise because my neck is so tense especially when I like sometimes drive too much the posture is if you like if you sit for long in the same position and doesn't support your head properly nah it tends like you have like a hip uh, neck pain I can tell you like when I stretch my neck it's cracking some some people got really big head and they have like small smaller body 
I cannot imagine how heavy their head. They have bigger head. Sometimes before I used to have a really long hair. I love long hair. And then it's really heavy. When I cut my hair, it feels good. It's like light. And like, you know, you don't... You just feel good. But if... Uh, I'm getting old now, so... <laughs> I don't like long hair anymore. It's hard to maintain. And, and then it takes ages to comb your hair especially we have kids you have no time for those it's just hard to maintain long hair and you need to buy expensive uh, good uh, uh, conditioner shampoo and it's heavy I feel heavy in my head <laughs> right. Just like this, because my really my shoulder feel good. This place here, this area is about like uh, forty-five minutes to the city of Perth. So there's no ocean around here. It's all like farm, big trees, bushes. The city is close to the river and ocean, but not in this area. You need to travel at least 45 minutes to go to the see the ocean. Like a few years ago, it was like a very, um, not a bushfire around here I was so like it burned some of those um, trees around the freeway but luckily it didn't come around here it was so close you can see a lot of big shopping, cent uh, shopping centers here and residential area it only luckily there's no house been burnt but it burned the, a lot of uh, like um, white bush trees. Because it gets hot in Western Australia sometimes. No, summer it really gets hot. gives a lot of ants here big big black ants I scared the red ants that big red ants my god it's really when it bites you are really painful in this area guys it's not very safe here if you walk around during the night people are being attacked from the train station some of them being murdered <laughs> so yeah I don't go muck around here during night time for sure it's not a safe area but daytime is not that bad not night time slippery because I put some sunscreen and slippery I do my exercise properly slip Oh. 
Oh gosh, my arms are slippery. I don't know why the sunscreen is very oily. Weird. All right. I'm gonna do some uh, jumping jack. Just getting really thirsty. Cars are passing by, trains are passing by. All right, guys, thanks so much for watching. Please subscribe, comments, and share. Bye.